Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong Country. Woohoo! World 3, Vine Valley. Vulture Culture. I hate these stages with a burning passion. Even when I used to play it as a kid, I just hated it. Lag spikes and all. Except I didn't have lag spikes because I actually had a Super Nintendo. That wasn't recording junk. But I'm pretty sure if my Super Nintendo were recording junk, it would be lag as hell. Oh, super rendered graphics, why? More of the barrel timing jump. Oh my. Lag. There we go. Hello. Boink, 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 boink. Grab it. Turn around. Done. Secret. These are claptraps. I don't know if we've experienced these. Old. Oh, I suck so hard. I'm, I'm gonna have to look up the virtual dub thing, because I'll be bothered uh, out otherwise. I'm gonna look up virtual dub. Matt, you're right. I need it. You can't throw up in this game? Really? I'm, I'm sorry, that was totally wrong. But, um, yeah, in Donkey Kong Country too. like, I've been playing that to, like, relieve stress, because I haven't been able to record, and that that's stressful as hell. But, um, nine times out of ten, I always threw up whenever I wanted to kill something above me. But the stage shouldn't last too much longer, so I can... Whoop. No, I'm just ignoring you. You're pointless. And I didn't... Lag! Oh my god, that's embarrassing. Yo. Come on. Stop failing. I've been recording for like 50 seconds and you're already failing. Damn you, Wade. Die. And die, all of you. Like, have a nice day. One word. I'm sorry, my commentary is already dying. Run! Oh my god. That was horrendous. No lie. And boop. And boop, and boop, and... Wait for it. Uh, could've gone. Did go. Woo! Run. Yay! We don't suck ass. Next is Treetop Town, one of the two designs I actually like out of a stage. There's a bonus back there, but I'm ignoring it for the sake of making up time. And Treetop Town is all about the timing with the barrels again. There's one section that completely peeves me off in such a way that I care not to tell. It's evil. Allow me to say that much. I'm definitely virtual dubbing this. Because it's going to be all sorts of jumpy and laggy and I apologize. And I missed. I'm awesome. Suck barrel, bitch. See, if you didn't time that right, the auto-fired barrel will knock your ass out. Anyway, there's a bonus down here. Rather nicely hidden one, actually. But there should be a letter this way. I lied. I suck. Apologize. Apologize, Wade. Apologize to your viewers for sucking so hardcore. And... Did I miss them all? Really? Fuck you, Diddy. I used to love you, man. I'm just getting so lucky. Oh crap! The autofire barrels get me every time. Every time. Like, no kidding. Suck it. Suck it hard. And eat me. Not caring. I just want to get through this stage. That's all I want. Is that too much to ask for a laggy ass game? This game, since it's like not really all that hard, it takes cheap deaths where- see? It, it tries its hardest to kill you very cheaply. Like, I, I don't quite understand it myself, but you know, it does, it does a good job at what it does. There we go, we're out. Go us. High five, camera! Yes. I so totally high fived a webcam. Cause that's where my camera, my mic is. 
die you. Wait, I didn't even jump on him because of lag. Anyway, the gimmick of this one, Forced Frenzy, I think, is uh, moving ropes. The most annoying kind of rope in this game, honestly. See, they'll scope back and forth. Often with... Often. Often with obstacles in the way. As such. That is your only safe spot for that, trust me. This one stands still, but then starts going. Where are these ropes attached to? Nintendo Logic. Is attached to physical Nintendo Logic. Because it's something you can't explain and don't really want to try to. But yeah, this is the gauntlet. The non-moving gauntlet we're about to go through. Don't let that halfway barrel lie to you. We're not even close to halfway through this mess. I hate this stage. Gave me nightmares as a kid. And now the bees move. In a semi-predictable pattern. But more often than not, you're going to get caught up in the oops of the moment. Oh god, lag. If I die ever on this stage, it's going to be lag. And now there are the slower moving, but more persistent bees. And I almost went right off the rope. Oh my god. This is a dangerous stage, guys. Oh my... Cheap death, a ho. Ahoy. And now there are vultures flying at you. Flying at you. And those two and those four, actually, it seems. And I completely... Jack that up. Go me. Suck it. Screw the bonus. I'm out. Later. Go diddy go. Next, we have Temple Tempest. The last of the temple themed stages, if memory does serve me correctly. And. K. K. K Bueno. That's cool. Um. Just run there, monkey boy. The gimmick of this is not only the ropes, but those little naughties in the, uh... Roller stone thing. Grindstone, whatever. Trying to crush the life from your little monkey heads. Which is never fun. And... I got killed by a naughty. Damn. There weren't all... All certification I had to, to play this game in the first place. Seriously, I have no right to play this game anymore. Switch. Tag out, yo. I rolled. Liar. Lying sack of crap game. Why do you torture me like this? You know they're doing this on purpose, right? It's like torture. Ha! Jump that time. Can't touch this. Ha! Halfway. Almost missed that. I'm definitely gonna have to do virtual dub. Because this is killing me. And it's gonna be killing you to have to watch this nonsense. I just jumped into a B pit. More like walked into it. Bonus! Haha! -ha. Claptrap, don't care. Gimme nanners. Nanners. Gimme nana. Oop. Ha! <laughs> I was banana hungry. It's like power hungry, only not. Hello, Ren. Ooh, holy crap. That almost ended horrifically. At least I already hit the halfway barrel. That is one less thing I have to worry about always and forever. Gummy. Run, monkey. And jump when I ask you to, please. That is of the utmost importance. Why did I go for that? That gives me even less time than I had before. Oh my god, I'm about to die. <laughs> called it. Totally called that. Onward. Let's try this again. See, this is going to be its own video. Want to know why? Because I don't feel like doing this in the ice world back to back. That's just going to give me an aneurysm. I'm not joking either. I'm going to aneurate just by thinking about that. Ugh. That is recording hell in the softest sense of the term. So from all this desync. And me running off a cliff. That might have something to do with my anger issues. Damn it. Okay. I got this, yo. I got this. We have the power. We are the monkeys. The monkeys of life. 
You doubt me? Don't doubt the monkeys of life. Why am I calling them the monkeys of life? They have nothing to do with life. If these monkeys proved anything, it's the lack of life. I have no life. Regardless of the fact my girlfriend's sleeping upstairs. Why did I... I have no idea this way. I really don't. Because you made the ceiling head. That likes to die. In a video game. Likes to die in real life too. He, he does it a lot. You're talking to a zombie, yeah. Folks, don't believe your TV monitors at the moment. Or your computer monitors, or however you deal with this technology mess. I know I have a laptop, and it's freaking awesome now, because somebody fixed it. In such a case, thank you, Lee. You, sir, are a pro at what you do. And what you do is you fix my computer. It's still a sack of crap, because if it weren't a sack of crap, this wouldn't be lagging. However, it's less of a sack of crap now. He also got me this mic, and I died again. Go me. I'm stuck on the stage, really. Of all the stages to be stuck on, I'm stuck on the one that I used to give me the least trouble out of all of them. Oh my god. Wade, man. Get off your ass and play the game. Please. Just, just play the game. Play the game like the pro you is. Or the pro, the pro you claim to be, because I used to rock ass at this game, yo. Come on, yo. Quit running into the motherfucking grindstone. I have to die somehow, right? You know. This is just foreboding for number two. That's all this is. This is... This is the crime of the highest accord. I'm going to die hardcore. Especially with the game not jumping when I want it to. Hello game, I'm talking to you. Making it very touch and go here, yo. I don't care how bad this lags, guys. You're going to see it. See it in a Donkey Kong glory. Why? Because I said so. Maybe it's just my emulator acting up. I have no clue. But when I tried to record this, like... It was a month ago about now. Yeah, it was about a month ago. Holy balls. This is going to suck. Ha! I made that jump? Are you for reals? Happy camper. Happy camper. Yes. Out of there. <laughs> Win. Candy save point. Yes, please and thank you. Jump in. How long have we been? We've been at this for not even like 12 minutes. That's great. About 12 minutes. Orangutan gang! Now there's an extra awesome gimmick for this stage. And his name is... Lanky Kong. However, if you throw this barrel and then jump on it, you get a free ride. Awesome. And you just keep going. Until here. Okay, Wade. Quit fucking around and play the game. Play the game like it was meant to be played, little boy. I'm 19, why did I just call myself little boy? And don't you dare clap trap. Shove it up your nostrils. Haha. -ha. Shove it up, all y'alls. All y'alls. And why? Why, for the love of Christ, do I run into everything lethal to my life? Can anyone explain this to me? Am I suicidal? Anyway, here's Express here for the first time. Look at his awesome birdiness. And thankfully, he has really long legs, so Claptrap, whether it be on purpose or an accident, the programmers didn't let him get hurt by Claptrap. I'd like to think they did it on purpose. What the hell? Whatever. Onward. Expresso is more for jumping, not for attacking. He has like no offensive prowess at all, and there he goes. I want him back! Give me my birdie! Ha! Let's go, ostrich boy. Ha ha! End of the stage. I think that was like the first time I ever took him all the way through the end of the stage. It's awesome. Anywho, Clam City. Let's roll. Second underwater stage. 
Second of three, I do think. I think. Am I right? I don't know. Uh, Ongar, let's go, dude. Let's make this stage easy. Anyway, as the name Clam City could often suggest to you, there's lots of clams. I like clams. Clams are awesome, sauce. So. Oh, why? Thank you. Not die, Fishy. Die. Die. Hello, clam. I like clam chowder. Yes. Not so much. No, well, actually, I like chowder in general. Can I have my swordfish back so I can like storm through this stage as if it were nothing? Thank you. On guard makes all water stages completely reasonable. Otherwise, they're like not unreasonable, but manageable. I think is the word I'm looking for. I don't know. He's around a lot less in uh, Donkey Kong Country 2 and 3. Of course, there are far less water stages in this one, but oh well. You know what I mean. He's less of a presence in 2 and 3 than he was in the first one. Which kind of makes me depressed because he was one of the more fun ones. Anyway, we are already done with this stage. And I, I, I care to believe that this game is the reason I hated bees as a kid. Because here we have Bumblebee Rumble for the third boss. And we want Diddy for this. Oh look, a gigantic freaking bee. I can see me dying a lot, actually, because the lag is not going to be friendly. However, she turns red and you can't hurt her while she's red. So you just wait for her to start flashing, and then she goes yellow, and then she charges you even faster. So she, she's a tad bit of a bitch. Beach. Huh. Be beach. Get it? No? No? No one? Nope. Didn't think so. I didn't get it either. I don't feel bad for you guys. Anyway, she's dead now. On your ass, B. We're, we're viciously slaughtering animals. I just got that. Anyway, next time we are going to hit up the Gorilla Glacier. Hope you're ready, because I'm not. See y'all next time, guys. Take care. Bye.